Hello friends, it's Anya. It has been a really long time since I've done a food vlog thing. So, um, yeah, it's the 31st of August. Tomorrow's the 1st. And I've had two months of excuses. Um, bad timing, bad choices, and I'm just kind of sick of it. I've been, so I started at 2.20 and I got down to 2.03-ish and now I'm back up to 2.13. So that's two pounds less than when I started, which is no bueno. Um, I think the last food vlog I had was when I was going to uh, Chicago for the Supernatural Convention. Um, I came back... Like, July 15th? I think so I just uh, need to get back on the horse because I've been neglecting the horse for two months <sighs> um, yeah tomorrow is the start of a new month I just need to do it again I just need to start prepping and planning and tracking because I Hi, Ella. Because I have not... I have not been kind to myself. My, my headspace has been, uh... Less than stellar. I had some random... Stuff happen, which... I don't really want to get into. I mean, it's not huge stuff. Oh, there's my kitty's tail. It's not huge, but it, um, it wasn't great for my headspace, so, um, yeah, I just need to start again. Um, I have not been good to myself, so, uh, I just need to start doing that again. Sorry for the super emotional bullshit. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm just, I think I'm uh, done with excuses. I'm going to clean my kitchen some more because I, I am super unmotivated. I'm super unmotivated to cook and eat well if my kitchen isn't clean and that's been something that I've been fighting with for uh, since I moved in here so uh, I'm just gonna I work tonight at midnight so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get off of here I'm gonna clean um, I'm gonna try prepping uh, like three dinners three lunches, and three breakfasts, but I also need to clean my fridge because I, I keep on going shopping and then I don't do anything with the food that I'm buying. So I need to do that too. Uh, but, and not to sound like super squishy and stuff, but um, Celia and Cherie have kind of been, like, I mean, they don't know. <laughs> but they have been a repeated bright spot in my day. <laughs> so, I just want to say thank you to them. Cause you ladies are amazing. Uh, 
<laughs> yeah. So I've embarrassed myself. I'm gonna go. Bye. Hello. Pulled myself together. Well, like emotionally. <laughs> um, I'm in my kitchen. It's crazy. I'm gonna uh, turn you guys around so we can take a look at <laughs> uh, what we have to work with. See you when I flip you around. <laughs> All right, so this is my kitchen. There's the top of my freezer. Need to clear that off. Need to put these away and then put those where they're supposed to go. I'm keeping my char Fitbit off because I'm going to be washing dishes and I don't want it to get wet. And uh, this is the rest of my kitchen, guys. Need to throw those bananas, well, put those in the fr freezer. Clean all of this crap. Clean that, organize that, and then just kind of figure out what to do with that. And, um, here's my fridge. And, um, like, look at the, look at the door. Even that is, like, super duper stuffed. So I need to go through here, decide what I want to use and prep and everything so I can kind of par down on all of this. And, um, I'll see you guys, like, in an hour or two, and we'll see how well I've done. <laughs> Alrighty guys, so I found Mike's Hard Strawberry Lemonade, and um, these suckers are 11 points a piece, so I can't, I can't do that, and I hate being wasteful, but I, this would be like a trigger for me guys, if I was to actually drink one, I would end up drinking like three or four, uh, four would be 44 points, guys, I can't do that, so I'm just dumping them out. Getting rid of the uh, temptation. So yeah, making teeny tiny 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 steps forward, guys. Teeny tiny. Alrighty, so um, I just cleaned off my oven, so I might as well do a grocery haul. Um, this one is going to be Walmart. I'm going to do another one here in a second. That's going to be Trader Joe's. So. From Walmart, we have the Bistro Blend Salad. It has romaine lettuce, butter lettuce, baby red lettuces, and radicchio, which sounds exciting. I haven't had that before. And then I have leafy romaine salad, which is like super basic and I love it. I also have tricolor coleslaw, and I also have broccoli slaw, which I don't know why, but I've been loving having these two slaws um, on my wraps. It's been really satisfyingly crunchy. Um, also have some Sleepy Time Vanilla, some Vanilla Chai, and Pumpkin Spice. Uh, Bigelow was one of my favorite teas to get. Um, like, I really like Tivana, Tivana, but it's expensive, and I don't, uh, get out very often because I don't have a car, so Bigelow is, uh, is my jam. And then, um, so I had saw somewhere, uh, I can't remember the exact video, but the Nature's Own Butter Bread. Um, I don't know about you guys, but butter's one of my favorite things, but, uh, I try not to have it because it's very high in points, but butter bread sounds, uh, sounds like something worthy of the gods. So this was, I believe two smart points for one slice, three smart points for two, which is awesome. I also have uh, some Joseph's Lavash bread. It's one point for half, two points for the whole thing, which it's huge. And then I also got some of these Colonel Seasons. I got nacho cheddar, some garlic parmesan, and I also got kettle corn, which I thought this would be interesting maybe on uh, my overnight oats, but the two savory, the nacho and the garlic parmesan would be really good on some vegetables. Then I also have minced garlic. I've opened that already. I've used quite a bit. And I've also used my Louisiana hot sauce. And then Frida's Rockin' Ram Bhutan. So... I'm pretty sure these are what I know them as as lychees, 
um, a lot of Asian snacks and drinks and stuff that are lychee flavored. It's one of my favorite things. Everything's my favorite thing. Um, but yeah, I saw those in there and I'm like, oh my gosh, I love lychee. So um, I'm going to be trying that out, seeing if it's actually what I thought it was. I have four Fuji apples. I also have four um, white peaches, which I love white peaches. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love regular peaches too, but white peaches, I don't know, they just, uh, I love them more. <laughs> and I also have the Take and Shake uh, potatoes and cheddar cheese flavor and the Microwave Ready Three Cheese Little Potato Company. If I remember correctly, these are four points for the whole thing, and this is... I think five points for half of the package, but I mean, it's a fairly big package. I could go ham on some potatoes. I also have the Opa Avocado Cilantro dressing and the Olive Garden Light Italian dressing. I can't remember the points on those, but I know they were low, which is why I snagged them. Um, I also, I usually get the Dannon triple zero fat-free Greek yogurt but they didn't have it at Walmart so I got the great value light Greek vanilla so I think this is three points either for half a cup or a whole cup I don't know I will um, correct that if I'm wrong and then I also have craft singles skim milk these are um, zero points for one slice I hi kitty I have land of frost roast beef sandwich meat this is one point for five five slices and Hormel turkey pepperoni 15 slices are one point and I also have this little guy here so it's called a uh, cheote squash I don't know if I'm saying that right but it looks like a pear and I love pears but I don't have no idea what to do with this but I figure I'll try something I'll branch out and then I have these guys here so I've been loving putting these yogurts in my overnight oats. I will use the um, Great Value Greek yogurt in a pinch, but I really like how flavorful and creamy these are. So we have tiramisu, we have pumpkin pie, strawberry cheesecake, banana cream, caramel apple pie, and peach. Now I think all of these, except for, I haven't checked the, um, I haven't checked the pumpkin pie one yet, but I think this one's three. I think this one's three points for the whole thing. And then I also have sugar snap peas. I have green onions, some celery, and we have some green seedless grapes. And then this guy right here is a uh, chopped pineapple. I wanted to go ahead and get that done when I when I came home. So. Um, I've had that chopped for a bit, but yeah, that's my grocery haul from Walmart. I'm pretty excited, guys. I think this is like a solid, this is a solid week of food. I can eat well. I can eat well with all of this. Hello again, friends. Um, it is 4.33 in the afternoon. I found this Healthy Choice Power Bowls Korean inspired beef bowl and uh, it just sounded so good. So um, their dark leafy greens, blend of chale, <laughs> blend of charred kale and spinach, seasoned braised beef, there's the vegetables, carrots, bamboo shoots and shiitake mushrooms. There's grains, a mixture of whole grain, brown and red rice, red quinoa, and black barley. And the sauce is a savory gochujang. So gochujang is uh, usually just like a sweet, spicy, red chili paste. So I've, uh, I've microwaved this already. And now I'm just going to kind of try it. So I'm going to mix this all up and then I'll see you in a second when I put it in my face hole. All right, so it's mixed, and I'm gonna get me a nice bite here. So this is going in my face. It's still hot from the microwave. <laughs> 
Okay, so that's really, really good. Um, it says that it has a spice level of two out of three of the peppers they have on the packaging. I would say that's pretty accurate. Um, because gochujang kind of has like a sneaky heat, like you're like, oh, this is really nice, peppery, sweet, and then, oh dear sweet lord, my mouth's on fire. So, just kind of keep that in mind. You know, the, the quinoa and the rice and the barley, delicious, it's very tender, has a little bit of a texture that I really like. And uh, the beef is good, surprisingly saucy, so they didn't skip on that. Skimp, skimp on the sauce, which is good because I love me some gochujang, but yeah, I found this at Walmart. If you like spicy stuff, it's like an Asian equivalent of a burrito bowl. That's a win-win. <laughs> um, this whole thing is eight points. The only thing I wish that I had would be kimchi at home, <laughs> so I can like supplement it it's so good guys I need to get 15 more mmm mmm so good <laughs> alrighty friends just doing some meal prepping um like a little bit so I'm making a spicy chicken salad here I have two twelve hold on two twelve and a half ounce um, canned chunk chicken so that is there in that bowl I shredded it up as well so it has like a good texture going on here I have some garlic powder I have some chopped pickled jalapenos chopped zesty uh, velastic pickle spears and uh, diced celery I have one of the little mini spicy holy guacamole cups and I have some chopped uh, broccoli slaw and then uh, this is gonna be like my creamy mix so this is three uh, tablespoons of the 0% craft mayo as well as one tablespoon of the sriracha right there and then I put um, juice of half a lemon in there as well and then I have some minced garlic and salt and pepper. I'm going to save those two until the end. I'm going to put everything else in here. Uh, and uh, I'll taste it, see what I think. If it still needs something, I'll go ahead and put some salt and pepper in this bad boy here. So yeah, I will be back um, after I uh, start mixing. Alrighty, I'm back. I got everything mixed. Uh, and we're gonna, we're gonna taste it. Okay, so that's not bad. I think it needs more pickle, more jalapenos. I definitely need to have some red onion or just regular chopped onion in there. And... Yeah. So yeah, I think I need to chop everything instead of dice everything so there's a bit more crunch, a bit more of a difference in texture. Oh, I ended up adding um, one tablespoon of Beaver brand hot cream horseradish for one point. So I think that brings the total bowl to a total of 12 smart points, which isn't terrible, especially since I'm uh, probably not going to eat the entire thing all at once. I mean, oh, excuse me, I could eat the whole thing, 12 points wouldn't kill me for the day since I haven't eaten a whole bunch, eaten, eaten a whole bunch of food today. Um, didn't need any extra salt, didn't need any extra pepper. I did have to add some more um, Louisiana hot sauce. Some uh, droopaloops loops in there. So that's for zero points as well. Um, yeah, this is actually really good. So I think it'd be good like in a lettuce wrap or just a regular wrap in general. 
um, maybe toast some bread and have a chicken salad sandwich with a slice of fat-free craft single for zero points. Um, 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 or just with a spoon. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I mean, I've cleaned. You can't really tell. I've cleaned a little bit. I did some more meal prep over here with the chicken. I have a teriyaki chicken and a chili lime lemon uh, garlic marinating right now. So two different flavors. We'll see which one I like more. Washed some cherries. Chopped up some white peaches. And yeah. Ooh, and I brewed some really strong. Okay, I know it's silly. But I have them in Velasic pickle jars. I don't like wasting glass jars if I can help it. Uh, if I can use it for something, I try to do that instead of throwing it away. So I have really strong hot coffee that I brewed that I'm letting it cool off so I can have iced coffee later. I froze some coffee ice cubes so it doesn't water down. You know, have some fat free, half and half, sugar free. Um, coffee creamer, stuff like that, and yeah, so I, I, I feel accomplished today. It is the results aren't super duper great, um, but you know the, the effort was there, and I haven't put any effort in anything Weight Watchers related or like my personal health journey related in a, in, in like two months. So while it isn't perfect, at least. It steps in the right direction, and here's hoping I'm gonna keep on going in the right direction because I, I need I need to go for less, not more. So well, more food prepping, less bad food. So with that, I'm gonna go ahead and be done for the day. Um, I will be starting what I ate videos, if not tomorrow, very very soon. I also have two Stitch Fix reviews, one Ipsy review, and one um, blind makeup challenge that I did with my roommate. Um, so I have four additional videos to upload besides this one, but I want to get this one up soonest. The most soon. <laughs> um, but thank you guys so much for watching. You guys are awesome. Stay awesome. Have a good day.